follow this tutorial, you need to have Mac OS 10.5.7 or greater and Logic 9. Open Logic and create a new session. Click on Preferences, Audio. Choose one for your output and input device. For now, set the buffer to 64. For best latency performance, you can set it to 32. However, you may need to adjust the buffer higher depending on the size of the project you are working on. Make sure that Software Monitoring is selected. Click on Apply Changes and close the Preferences window. Open the Apogee One control panel by clicking on Options, Audio, Open Apogee control panel. Here you can select from the different One input choices. Internal mic allows you to record with One's internal microphone. Simply place One in front of the source that you want to record. External mic is for connecting your favorite dynamic or ribbon mic to One's XLR breakout cable. External 48 volt mic is for connecting a condenser mic to One's XLR breakout cable. Instrument is for connecting a guitar or bass to the quarter inch instrument input. With output, you can choose between stereo for outputting to headphones or speakers, or amp if you want to run the output of one to a guitar amp. This is great if you want to use Logic's guitar effects through your guitar amp in a live setting. After connecting the output of one to headphones or speakers, click on Logic's Record Enable button. You will now hear the input source you have plugged in. You are now ready to record.